What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Flicking on My Big Tarot, here where I bring you the beauty, juice, and spiritual juice. I'm your spirit guide host, Miss DC. And today, you guys, we are back with another general reading for the sign of Leos. Please understand this will not apply to every single Leo, as every single Leo is not going through the same scenario. Cross watchers, anybody outside the Leo energy, you're more than welcome to join in, tune in. But please utilize this information for your most positive purpose. Spirit told me to talk to you, so I have a couple of decks that I will be talking to you with. For more information, everything will be in the description box below. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And if this is so, drop a tip in my cash app and let me know, okay? Without further ado, my lovely, lovely Leos, I'm talking to you. A Leo friend of mine passed away want to say a few months maybe almost a year ago and I thought about him so much in some of my videos on Instagram you can check it out I have his pants on and he's a Leo that I just I don't stop thinking about and I don't understand why we weren't really that close but we were Ben Billy shout out to my Ben Billy rest and relaxation in a higher realm message of concern see what did i say y'all you might be receiving a message of concern or writing a message of concern maybe somebody is concerned about something or maybe you're concerned about something in a family room Maybe um, maybe you need a family meeting or maybe there's going to be a family meeting that takes place. Maybe you're going to be sitting in your family room when you receive this information. Maybe you need to be in a, around a family. I just get like, we need to have a talk like as a family, like this is a family concern or a message of concern, maybe from a family. If that, I just get you all need to sit down and have a talk about something that's concerning someone, a situation. And I just, and this is my, from my Kipper deck, I just got my, my Kipper cards and I'm so excited about using them. And the messages have just been wild. So we're going to get some and we're going to see. Ah. Let's get some messages. Yes, like, uh. Okay, May, you see how that one was flipped out there? Maybe you're making a good decision. Maybe you're about to make a good decision. Maybe you made a good choice in a scenario. Um, I feel like you're doing the right thing. Maybe you want to reach out to somebody or somebody is reaching out to you. Somebody is, I feel like you're making a decision to do the right thing. Maybe this is about something from the past. I get like a possible past situation. Maybe something from the past. Yeah, some type of truth is coming out. Maybe saying the right thing or doing the right thing, or I feel like in doing the right thing, um, a truth is gonna be exposed. Maybe somebody's gonna see something for what it is. I feel like maybe you have to, I feel like maybe you have to prove something and you're going to make the right decision. And the truth about something is going to come out, like something is going to be revealed and it's going to influence you to build. I feel like you're going to see the truth about something, like you're going to feel and see the truth about something. It's like having an epiphany. <laughs> Something you're going to, yeah, I feel like something, you're going to see something. You're going to, you're going to see something. It's going to help you to build in some way, form or fashion. Um, yeah, I feel like something, I feel like a harsh truth. It, it might, but it, it's like, it might be a harsh truth, but it might help you to build at the same time. 
it's like maybe I feel like maybe you're you're manifesting this. This is something that you want. This is something that you want to happen. This is something that you're trying to build, whether it be a relationship or a system or there's something here that you want to build. And the truth about it is going to be exposed. It's going to come to the light. It might even, I don't even know. It's like, it's just going to come out. Maybe it's just going to, maybe there's going to be a situation where something just explodes or something is just going to come out. Chariot card, look at that. Action moving forward at a quick pace. I feel like you're gonna get the truth. Of, I feel like you're something is just gonna hit you. And like, maybe it'll be an idea or some form of truth, some form of enlightenment or, or, or a good decision. It, you're gonna see it and you're just gonna go for it. It's like, maybe you're walking one way and you're do, 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 do. And then all of a sudden it's like a boom right in front of you. And it's like, oh my God, what the fuck is that? So then you turn around and then you quickly go the opposite way. It's like, I'm not going towards that shit. I'm not running towards that shit. I'm gonna run the opposite way. <clears throat> so I feel like you're gonna see like a harsh truth about something. And then once you see it, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's just gonna put some, if and you yeah like I feel like it's gonna cause you to be like you know what fuck this like no we're not doing this it might cause you to be a little bit bitter it might cause you to be a little angry detached I feel like whatever this is is gonna put you in a not so good mood like it may it's it may anger you a whole heck of a lot like it may infuriate you I feel like you're going to be infuriated with something. Like you might really be angry, like sincerely angry with something, just like bitter, cold. And like, you might get on this. You can't tell me what the fuck to do type of attitude. Something is going to just push you. It's like something is going to make you a little bit evil, but just it's like you're evil, but it's it's worth it or it's well warranted it's like shit like I see the truth in something something just hit me and now it's gonna fucking force me to want to just build but it's gonna make me a, a a motherfucker it's like like maybe somebody hurt you or maybe somebody did something to you and reality set in and it's like damn I cannot do this <clears throat> like I need to build and my focus is on building, but I'm gonna be a I'm gonna be a B-I-T-C-H if I was a female about it. See, don't do it. Right under the judgment card, it says don't do it. I feel like do the right thing. Maybe you were thinking to do one thing, but it's like you have to do the right thing, or something is saying don't do it. You know what I'm saying? Maybe, I don't know, don't do it. And you'll know whether you're supposed to do it or not. I feel like drink water. Maybe you need to drink water, Leo. Maybe you're on fire. Maybe something is on fire. Maybe you need to cool off. That's what I feel like. Maybe you need to cool off. I feel like maybe you're too heated. You see, you got the, the fire, the fire here and all this craziness, but then <clears throat> you got the um, drink water and you know, cactus has water on the inside of it, I believe. Cactus has water on the inside, but it's dry on the outside. You know what I'm saying? So equate that however you like, but something is saying you need to drink water or maybe, you know, something is wet. Maybe what you're doing is like telling water not to be wet. It's like telling something not to do something, but it's like, I'm literally made to do this. That's it. I think you, you have an idea and that's fucking it. You're getting ready to go with building with it. You may have to travel. Like I said, you may have to travel. You may have to drive to do something. 
But yeah, you got to be creative. Enough is enough. Enough is a fucking enough. There's a couple of other signs that I needed to drink water too, Leo. So don't think, <laughs> excuse me, you're the only one. Because you're not. You have free will. So I feel like in whatever decision, I feel like something might be saying don't do it. I feel like maybe you shouldn't do it, but you want to. But spirit is saying you have free will. You can choose to do A and get the pros and cons to that, or you can choose to do B and get the pros and cons to that. It's just, what are you going to be willing to do? Make sure you understand what it is before you make any rash decisions on anything, because sometimes you never know how long a phase or a cycle is going to go, but stay determined. I feel like you're, you are determined to build. You are determined to manifest certain things that you want out of the relationship or out of the situationship, whatever it is, business, maybe it is business. I feel like you're going to be traveling soon for business or maybe your job requires you to travel, but there's a situation or a scenario here that I feel like a family needs to discuss. Maybe it involves a baby. Maybe it involves a baby. Or maybe someone is, is mishandling a baby. I don't know why I'm picking that up. I know why I'm picking it up, but it's just like, there's a message of concern from family, but this is also has to do with business. Remember to respond rather than react, right? So I feel like this is a family situation and maybe you feel like, hey, I'm, I'm like in my own fucking energy. Like I'm the fucking boss. I'm gonna say and do what I want because of what I heard. Like I'm not gonna take what I heard and then just allow it to make me give your creativity the space it needs to flourish. Yeah, like- it's like, nah, fuck that. I'm not dealing with this. I'm dealing with what I want to deal with. And you have free will to do it, but make sure you know what it is that you're doing. If you don't, you better. 